back we are in microsoft dynamics 365 business central frequently asked questions part 2 so in the previous video that is in the part 1 video we have discussed about all these questions like what is a business central uh, why choose a career and how to get started what is a business central functional consultant will do what skills does a fixed functional consultant need how much does a business functional consultant earn and what does a business central developer do so um in this video we'll be discussing few more questions so before that uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel this is my channel gomes tech talks if you haven't subscribed please go and subscribe now and this is my linkedin account so i'll be posting about various opportunities through linkedin so if you want to be a part if you want to follow me uh, in linkedin so please scan this qr code and this is a ebook store so this ebook store you can find various uh, important ebooks like uh, al programming bootcamp interview question and answer for business central microsoft dynamics 365 business central al al programming interview question and answers this is for developers freshers interview question and answer part 1 and here you can see 20 must have checklist for functional consultants so you can buy that from here so this is the ebook store um qr code i have also given this link in the description please go and watch that and if you have any queries and if you want to discuss with me related to your um uh, interview preparation and tips mock interview resume career guidance or anything you can just uh, schedule a call with me okay so you can just schedule a call with me whenever i'm free you can find the um, calendar and uh, or you can discuss uh, what is your uh, what is your interview like wh what um, type of services like resume review or uh, interview preparation tips you can just book it here so in this video we are going to discuss about how much does a business central developer earn what are the certifications you can do what qualification should you possess to become a business central developer how can you upgrade your knowledge and skills in business central what are the various career paths for business central and where i can search for jobs this is very very important thing i will not be discussing about the monster.com so i'll be discussing four important um, websites okay so you will be getting really uh, you will really feel uh, you will really feel wow in this particular Our question, and of course, in all the questions. So just watch it. So how much does a business central developer earn? So here you can find this much is the business central developer's cost. So I am showing you for the Australia junior developer, which is zero to three years of experience, they will earn one lakh five hundred dollars. Australian dollar. So mid level they will earn this, and senior level they will they will earn this. And this is for Belgium, this is for uh, Germany, this is for the Netherlands, this is for Spain, United Kingdom, and United States. So here you can find. Of course, we do have um, this much demand in India as well because Business Central um, covers the small to medium size business business ERP. So there will be a lot of demand. I'll be showing you how much demands do we have. So stay tuned till the end. So, what are the certifications should I possess? What are the certifications should, should you do? The very first one is if you want to become a functional consultant, then you have to go with the MB eight hundred. Okay, so you have to learn MB eight hundred here. So here you can see MB eight hundred if you want to become a functional consultant. So this is MB eight uh, hundred that is a, a business central functional consultant associate. uh just comment i'll be sharing this link for you okay just comment the certification link functional certification link i'll be sharing the link with you so once if you scroll down you can see various modules which is provided to you by microsoft itself so if you wanted to learn online you can learn this okay so almost all the topics which are here in mb800 i have already covered in a in this particular playlist okay that is bc functional consultant on o1 mastering the essentials you can start learning from here and also i have discussed about how you can crack mb800 exam that is a strategic study plan here in this link you can find that as well so this is for functional and if you want to become a developer then you have to learn mb820 so microsoft has launched the beta exam of mb820 in the month of february i think the month of uh, uh jan and the end of the jan they have launched it that is a beta version so beta exams are not available in few countries um that like uh, i think india turkey china so one more country i'm not sure about that country so 
I have also discussed about that particular um, certification MB820 in my channel that is in Gomes Tech Talks. You can find it in BC Tutorial Technical Consultant. I will be releasing more about this particular uh, certification, so please stay tuned. You can find the MB820 beta exam here, but the uh, self paced program is not available yet. I will be discussing about how to learn this particular uh, certification in my channel, so please stay tuned. So these two are the basic and important associate level certifications for functional as well as the developer. If you want to be very specific, for example, if you want to become a customer inside data speciali speciality or if you want to become a, a field service functional consultant associate, then you can definitely uh, see there are various certifications which are related. There are nearly 16 certifications. Okay. So you can find this even if you want to get the link, please comment it. Comment I need link for the certification. If you want to any specific certification like a developer certification or functional certification, you can also comment that as well. So this is for the functional consultant and developers certification. Next one. So these mid certifications we have for the uh, functional uh, specifically that is based on the field. Okay. So next one is what education qualification should I possess? So what specific education qualifications should you possess it worth? It's not basically much mandatory. So whatever the education you have seen, few will be having the mentality or mindset of an entrepreneur, but they'll be learning English okay, because of family pressure or something. If your mind is clearly up to learning something new, then you can definitely become okay. Or else I have few suggestions. So if you have done your business administration or management in your um, like MBA, BBA or something, then definitely you can choose business central functional consultant. Uh, so it this provides a solid understanding of the business processes, finance and management and principles. Then if you have completed your information technology or computer science or if you are very keen in learning coding, even if you are from a different domain, even if you are an IEEE or ECE, if you wanted to learn, if you are very eager to learn the coding and do some customizations and uh, writing the code, then you can learn AL programming. That is, you can become a developer, business central developer. That is to understand the technical aspects of the business central. If you are from accounting or finance, okay, if you are from a BCom commerce student or anything related to accounting or finance, then this will be easy and useful for you to work with the financial management because in functional consultant we have a specific thing called finance okay finance and operations are there so you can become a, a financial uh, that is a uh, even if you are if you are doing if you have done your masters or your um, uh, graduation in accounts or finance then you can definitely aim for this okay this is not limited to so we may be uh, doing the degree in different uh, different domain but we our mindset is up to a different domain then definitely you can choose it if you can really understand the concept of business administration and accounting and the finance so the next one is how can i upgrade my knowledge and skills in business central so this is a very important question so how you can upgrade your knowledge the first thing you can upgrade your knowledge is through a uh, several microsoft offers like a training courses and certifications okay so you can aim for the certification as i'm showing here so mb800 is a certification so you uh, microsoft learn is providing the uh, that is a free resource these all are free resource simply just select here you can start from the beginning okay like just start your free dynamics business central trial so you can start right from the here right from here so everything is very easy for you to learn okay you can read this okay so you can read this and learn start learning these things here so these all are free from Microsoft or else if you want to go with an instructor led training courses, then even there you have for the instructor led training course, Microsoft is offering instructor led training course for all these things as well. Okay, if you wanted to know how to search for this, how to find the instructor led training course, please leave the comment. So I will tell you the uh, way in a different video. Okay, other than this in my channel, you can find if you wanted to become a developer. So this is the uh, this is the playlist where you can learn BC tech tutorial technical consultant. If you want to learn functional consultant, if you want to become a functional consultant, I am conducting a boot camp right now where you can start learning what is a functional consultant, who can become a functional consultant, what are the key understanding you should have to become a functional consultant. So it is happening right now or else if you wanted to just learn 
here whatever is there in the mb 800 um, uh, this particular learning path i am covering all these things in this particular uh, playlist as well so you can learn from this okay so this is one way of learning the one way of doing that apart from that you can uh, participate in an online forum at, you can attend a webinar you can join the user groups which will really provide more insights about the business central and you can engage in the hands-on experience as well like you can go for the projects internships and you can explore more capabilities so the next one is what are the various career paths for business central so for specifically for business central we have business central consultant if you are a pba student or an mba student or accounts or finance if you can uh, really win the customers and the client heart and get the and uh, meet the requirements and understanding and you can be if you can be a bridge between your uh, uh, clients and the business then you can definitely become a business central functional consultant okay so a consultant which is specializes in implementing customizing and optimizing dynamics 365 solution to meet business requirements consultants often focus on either erp aspects like finance operation and business central or crm aspects like customer relationship management accept aspects like sales customer services and marketing you can become a business central developer though so this is the second chance second path like uh, this is not like see only if you become a consultant you can become a developer no so this much career path you have you can either go with a consultant or you can go with the developer you can become a developer so you should be like you can extend and customize the dynamics 365 through code like you have to write the code developers often use al programming language okay so you'll be using an al programming language which is an application language programming uh, so i have also discussed i have a bootcamp for al programming as well that you can find it in my uh, in my youtube channel that is uh, al programming bootcamp so here you can find al programming bootcamp this is 21 days bootcamp this covers entirely about right from the basics towards the advanced and also the interview question and answers for the bootcamps okay so you can either become a, uh, a consultant or a developer so anyone like if you are excelling in anyone you can become a uh, central project manager okay you can become a project manager so this is like dynamics 365 implementation projects you should ensure they are completed on time within a budget and line with the business objectives this role involves project planning resource allocation stakeholder management and risk management so of course to become a project manager you should have at least zero to five years luck sorry you should have at least three to five years of experience but to become a consultant or a developer you any any experience like zero to any number of years years of experience accordingly your position will be next one you can become a sorry i haven't added that here you can become a business central techno functional consultant okay techno functional is like they should they will be having the knowledge and skills on both technical and functional so to become a techno functional at least you should have two years of experience uh, in functional and the technical okay so so that you can just relate to two two plus two like either two to three years of experience in both functional and technical next to talk about is the business central trainer so that is my part this is my uh, 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 whole the, uh, thing so that is what trainer you can become a business central trainer if you know and if you are very eager to uh, talk and train the people about a business central then you can become a business central trainer so they'll be specializing in understanding the core concept uh, solving the doubts and everything so you can become a trainer then functional analyst you can become a functional analyst as well okay and finally you can become a techno functional okay techno functional the role which blends the technical expertise and with the functional knowledge enabling professionals to understand both business processes and the technical implementation so business analysis like uh, analyzing the documenting process business processes analyzing and documenting the business processes and requirements and you can also translate them into a system requirements so business analysts work closely with both business stakeholders and technical teams to ensure that dynamics 365 solutions meet business objectives okay so this is what you can become apart from this in every company so it has its own its own um, uh, uh, designations and positions you can definitely become then where can i search for jobs so this is very important one which you should or you all should know this okay 
so yes these four um, this four job portal is i liked it really and this is what the first one nigel frank international so this is an excellent job portal okay here you can find it this is by microsoft this is actually supported by microsoft itself okay so here you can find a this is see you can see microsoft recur- recruitment careers and jobs okay so here you can just go and search for um, business central developers okay so you can tell what is the area you want to go with business applications dynamics business central and just search for the job so once if you click search for the jobs you can see there are a lot of searches nearly 358 search results are there specifically for business central developer okay just go and search for it and find what are the job description what actually they are expecting for it from you okay so you can go and search for it i hope you really liked it right if you really liked it just comment wow so the next one is what the indeed indeed is really a great platform where you can search for but of course for indeed nakri and linkedin i don't want to specifically tell you how to search for it you can go and directly search like business central developer business central functional consultant so just search for it if you have any query in searching or if you want any clarifications in understanding it please leave the comment like you want to search you want to see how to search in indeed or nakri or in linkedin i will definitely help you out so these four uh, job portal will really help you out i hope you found this video useful so if you have any queries related to business central um anything so please just leave me a message leave the uh, comments i'll definitely help you out and if you have any queries and if you want to discuss that with you related to business central research or power app power automate whatever related to the techn- technology uh, please schedule a call with me i will be there to help you out So thank you take care and bye bye I'll meet you soon with the next exciting video